Pepe Jeans London. A denim history. In a time when fashion brands were made less by marketing science and cold cash, London designer Nitin Shah and his brothers, Aaron and Milan, started running a store at Portobello Market every Saturday, customising and supplying jeans with good design, quality fabrics and different finishes. In a few years, they had four stalls in the market and opened up their first boutique in King's Road. It was called saint Trading Company. But one day, Nitin Shah thought about changing the name to a shorter and more snappier, easier, two-syllable name. And Pepe was born. Pretty soon, they'd be ditching the full-time jobs in favour of operating their business from a 25,000 square metres warehouse and set up new office spaces in London. By 1980, Pepe Jeans London was rivalling with all the big US brands for number one spot in the marketplace becoming the UK's most successful jeans brand ever and began to take its first steps into new international markets. In 1984, the US dominance started with the opening of a new office and showroom in LA. The same year, the brand launched in Ireland. In 1986, Pepe Jeans hired the hottest fashion photographer of the decade, Bruce Weber, to shoot its biggest ad campaign to date and fueled by an appetite to articulate its message in a sexy and engaging way. Cinema and TV commercials soon followed, and each campaign has left an indelible mark in the annals of fashion advertising. In the 90s, the brand continued its expansion trail throughout Europe to include France, Italy, Germany, Spain, Holland, Portugal and Switzerland, which are some examples of countries where the brand grew vastly during the decade. By the start of the new millennium, Pepe Jeans London had confirmed its reputation as one of the biggest brands in the denim market and has continued with maverick photographers, directors and advertising faces destined to become the stars of tomorrow. In the last few years, the brand has expanded into emerging territories such as Latin America and Asia and has launched new lines including the rock-tinged premium denim collection 73 in 2002. Kids wear in 2004 The Andy Warhol by Pepe Jeans Collection, which launched in 2007. And more recently, the Teenagers Collection, Portobello by Pepe Jeans. The company today trades in 60 countries of the five continents, sells through almost 7,000 doors at wholesale, has over 300 stores internationally, and employs over 2,000 people, creating directional denims and challenging young fashion in an era dogged by conformism. Since the beginning on Portobello Road, Pepe Jeans has been able to excite and create leading trends. With no doubt, this winning formula will evolve in the coming years to keep on delivering one of the strongest denim-led fashions in the world. Welcome to Pepe Jeans. Welcome to our world.